What's up guys, Cheetah here, and today I'm bringing you an achievement slash platinum trophy walkthrough for Aquadine. This game is published by Radalac Games, and it's developed by Soft Colors, and you can pick the game up on August 26th. And to get the full completion, it'll only take you around 6 minutes following along with this video. This is another super easy visual novel, and as usual, before you get started, you want to go into these settings. And on the right side of the screen, you want to select skip all messages. And then from there, press the right bumper, and on this screen here, you want to turn the text and auto forward time to the maximum all the way over to the right. And then for the after choices option, you want to choose keep skipping. And then for transitions, choose none. And then from there, once you have those settings, we can return to the main menu, and we can start up a new game. Once you start up a new game, go ahead and press the right bumper to start skipping through the text and the visual novel is going to start playing itself and achievements are going to unlock on their own. And thankfully in this visual novel here, we don't have to make any decisions for this one. We just have to watch all five of the different endings. And once we do that, we're going to unlock a special memory scene that we can watch and that'll be our full completion and it's literally that easy. So for now, just keep skipping through the uh, text here and eventually we're going to get returned to the main menu and I'll show you guys how to start up playthrough number two. All right, and once you get to the end here, press the B button and return to the main menu. And this time we're gonna start up another game, but this time we're gonna choose to go to character select and we're gonna choose the character on the left with black hair. And then again, press the right bumper and start skipping through the text. And I'll pick the commentary back up for playthrough number three. All right, again, return to the main menu and then go to character select again. And this time we're gonna choose the second character, the girl with red hair. And then again, press the right bumper and skip through the text until we get to the end. And then I'll pick the commentary back up for playthrough number four. All right, and again, once you get to the end here, return to the main menu, go to character select, and this time choose the third character with short hair. Again, press the right bumper to skip through the text, and I'll pick the commentary back up once we get to play through number five. All right, and now we just have one more character left, so return to the main menu, go to character select, and then choose the fourth and final character all the way over on the right side. And then after we finish this one, we're gonna unlock the little memory section. So go ahead and skip through this, and I'll pick the commentary back up once we're done.
All right, and once you finish the fourth character, go ahead and return to the main menu. And at the bottom middle of the screen, you should now see a memory section. Go ahead and click on that, start that, and then again, press the right bumper to skip through it. And this is going to be the final section of the game. And after you watch this, that'll be your full completion. So that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like on the video if it was helpful. And please consider subscribing for more guides just like this if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next time. Shout out to my Patreon supporters, Chan Span G1, Tim G84, Fazo Prime Pirate, and Monarch Reptar. And last but not least, shout out to my legend supporter, Niku no Ni Oi. If you guys would like to support me on Patreon, you can do so at patreon.com slash cheetahsguides.